While the global population continues to battle the ongoing pandemic, planet Earth has been carrying on as usual. In fact, she has been healing. The worldwide slowdown in human activity has had a number of positive effects on the environment, including decreased air pollution due to less carbon guzzling planes in the sky and less fuel burning cars on the road. Here's how the planet is reacting positively to the global lockdown. Air pollution levels have reduced significantly. With industrial activity slowing down because of lockdown restrictions, new satellite imagery from the European Space Agency has found that air pollution levels in China and Italy are markedly lower than this time last year. Satellites orbiting Earth found lowered air pollution over Italy and lowered nitrogen dioxide emissions over China. Air pollution levels have also dropped in the UK. In fact, some cities have seen nitrogen dioxide levels fall by up to 60% on the same period last year. Seeing this drop in air pollution shows that less traffic can quickly lead to cleaner air. Once this dreadful situation is over, we don't want to rush to go back to where we were or worse, and we can't have an accelerated return to business as usual. We can have a better, cleaner future for ourselves and the planet. Over in India, the skies in some of the most polluted cities turned beautifully blue as locals were put on lockdown. Lockdown has improved the air quality index to satisfactory levels in nearly 90% of the 103 cities. Before we continue further, be sure to subscribe to the channel, that way you won't miss any of our weekly videos. People have been taking less flights. International air travel is one of the fastest growing source of climate emissions worldwide. As travel restrictions have been put in place globally, there has been a huge drop in the number of commercial flights, with many airlines grounding most of their fleet. The pandemic really has cleaned the skies, with one benefit being less air pollution levels. Previous studies found that airplane travel adds up to about 5% of global warming, so while the drop in flights might only be temporary for now, it certainly is giving our planet the chance to breathe. Animals have reclaimed land. It is clear that the lockdown of humans is helping nature and animals rediscover their natural spaces. With the lockdown, nothing is happening, and animals, be they fin whales or other marine species, are clearly rediscovering their confidence and peace, allowing them to come closer to shore. People will see animals roaming more freely during the pandemic. Since we are home, we should think about how animals are affected by human activity. We should tell ourselves that if we want to keep seeing nature, we must know how to respect it. Venice's canals have cleared up. Venice's famous canals are the clearest they have been in 60 years, thanks to pollution levels and tourist numbers in the Italian city rapidly dropping. With less boats on the canal, the once murky, grey waters are now crystal clear because the sediment is still. This has welcomed swans, fish and seabirds back to the canals. The water now looks clearer because there is less traffic on the canals, allowing the sediment to stay at the bottom. It's because there is less boat traffic that usually brings sediment to the top of the water's surface. One of the world's biggest tourist destinations, the streets of Venice are usually teeming with visitors from around the world. But, since lockdown has been put in place, nature has had the time to breathe again. The water is blue and clear. It is calm like a pond, because there are no more waves caused by motorized boats transporting tourists. And of course, the giant cruise ships have disappeared. People are reconnecting with nature. One of the good things to have come out of social distancing is that we are letting the outdoors recharge us. As the nature heals, so do we humans. We've been forced to pause, slow down, reflect and appreciate the little things our gardens and local walking paths have to offer from morning bird songs to the riot of pastel colors. There's something beautiful about reconnecting with the great outdoors, whether that's through gardening, outdoor walks or by simply sharing images of beautiful birds with others. Wherever you are, make time to reconnect with nature. It will certainly do you good. Do you think we should celebrate a lockdown week once every year? Let us know in the comments section. Hey guys, thanks for watching. If you like the video then make sure to subscribe to our channel 